Hello Capricorn, how are you? <laughs> this is the week of the 1st of August, so I'm going to ask the angels, universe and spirit guides to allow the great energies for Capricorn to come in. So Capricorn, what would you like Capricorn to know about the 1st of August, the week of the 1st of August for Capricorn, 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 Capricorn. Week of the 1st of August for Capricorn, what would you like Capricorn to know about the We get the first of August for Capricorn. First of August for Capricorn. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Capricorn. We get the first of August for Capricorn. First of August. We get the first of August for Capricorn. First of August. Universe angels. Spirit guides Capricorn week the first of August for Capricorn week the first of August for Capricorn. Week the first of August for Capricorn week the first of August for Capricorn. Okay. Have one more. Oh, thanks. All right, so. But with the deck Seven of Swords, someone's been sneaky. We've got Queen of Cups, you're honouring your heart, you're loving yourself, you're eating right, you're emotionally right, you you are looking into that ornate, antique gold, solid gold cup of you. You have probably been given money, or you're about to get some uh, security within the family. Uh, it's usually money, not as a result of your activity. So a lotto win, an inheritance, something like that. Um, it could be from a counsellor or you do counselling. There's this also, it's the counterpart for this queen. This king and queen are securing some kind of emotional stability within the family. Um, it's sexy, it's the devil, it's the cap because your element. So it's kind of like you might meet someone that is equal to you, that earns as much money as you, that wants a security as much as you. But There's a devil involved. There's a toxicity here. There's someone being very manipulative, and you're but you're you're tied like a puppet on a string, and you can't walk away from it. You can't walk away, and it makes you quite angry. This Capricorn here is upside down. The Capricorn that doesn't have earthness or hasn't got stability is upside down. It could be that someone comes in with love but really they want your security or the, the money that you have and you find that out or they've got a toxic problem and it leaves you unearthed it leaves you angry or this or you staying where you are not um You staying love, loving yourself might 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 expose this person as this this king of pentacles and this devil, um, and you realise that you've been stabbed in the back or you've been you're imprisoned by this thing. If you don't get out of it, maybe you're in something just for the money, and it's not making you your heart sing. And maybe this king of cups comes in to 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 make you realise it's about the love and not the money. Um, so you start, you, you feel that you're exposed or you're gossiped about in front of these people and a lot of stuff comes out of this box, Pandora's box, but the last one is hope. So your hopeful wish in love is going to come true, but not without uh, some kind of whew, reconciliation and then another ending. 
where you end it worse the second time and you say things you can't unsay and that brings about more drama but just when you think it's safe to go back in the water maybe someone just says the wrong wrong thing so you do drop from the 10 to the 5 but it brings about like a storm blows up um Because you want what you want or you your hopeful wish come true comes out, the thing you want is not without drama. It's not without, what's the word, repercussion, if you like. So if you think you're going to go smoothly without drama to get this wish, you know, people could just be angry that you get the money and they don't or... And then they're gossiping about it. But all this stuff comes out and you get the love as well and they don't. And it's sort of, it's, it becomes a battle of w wills. It becomes a battle, not wills, it becomes a battle of, of um, narcissism. Like, uh, you can destroy something that was quite nice. And had you have just left it there, you take it to the bridge. And it's like, no UF off, no UF off. <laughs> and people in between get injured and it brings about this, you can't get to the destination you wanted to because you took back this drama. That's what I'm feeling. So honour your heart, honour the stability of the home, okay? This King of Cups is coming to offer you some counselling or some kind of emotion. It's just that you're still tied somewhere or they're still tied somewhere with it to a drink habit of alcohol, gambling, could be to a marriage that they can't walk away from or you can't walk away from this, this uh, devil or this person that's, that's maybe lost all their money. It could be, this person could cause you to lose your um, groundedness because of their toxic behaviour. You could be too sexy for this person. And they're too emotional or vice versa. They're too emotional, not sexy enough. Well, you're too sexy and they're too emotional. But I think there's money between you. There's money, there's stability. There's someone who wants to work on love and stability. It's just this toxic person or Capricorn in the way. This sex is in the way or this drink is in the way. And that's what causes this person to be angry. So that makes you feel like you're on the floor and depressed. But there's a hopeful wish coming true. It's just that something needs to go to the bridge maybe before you can... It's... Just be careful what you say this week. People can be very hurtful with their speech. Because you get this wish come true and they don't like it. Let's ask... Now, and there's that deceit of the seven of swords under the deck. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Capricorn to know about the week of the 1st of August, the week of the 1st of August for Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Angels, spirit guides. Okay, so we've got new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. And love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. I think if you stay in a sex energy as opposed to a secure loving energy, it's going to upset you or this person. This is, this is love. It's not... Let's have a look. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. And reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Woof, so you've got new love and that and some someone from your past has turned to life. If someone comes back and you're representing and they've they've changed, they've got money or something, and you're representing as the devil and st stuck, or they're still the same and you've moved on. But because of these two Capricorn cards here, I don't think it's I think it's you that are trying to deal with them in the same way as before and they've changed. So that could upset you or upset them that one of you's changed. But it's love yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Love yourself first 
and then there's a reconciliation it's oh, i don't know i don't know if i don't if there could be two people there's two kings one's angry and one's offering love and you have to deal with them completely differently someone wants real love and security not sex and money It could be one person wants that and the other person wants that. It's odd. But there is a wish coming true. Once all the stuff comes out of the closet, maybe you get to terminate this past love. And yes, it creates drama because you go for the new love. Or you go <laughs> you go for the past love. I don't know. But someone's being deceitful. And you need to free yourself from something. It seems like you're stuck in this sexual energy and that's unearthing you and making you feel imprisoned you need to get be vulnerable in love you need to be having a like she's aquarius in love and she's on her knees and she gets this star this hope so don't say something you can't unsay or you'll bring in the drama and you can't get to your destination angel spirit guides what would you like capricorn to know sorry it's difficult it's just it's like you've Really concentrate on the family and your heart and who's bringing the love and who's trying to stay in a sexual, toxic, drinking, angry moment because that's not the one. Angels, spirit guides, even though it's, it's attractive. Love yourself first and free yourself. So we've got... Can't tell, it's too many. Let me ask Capricorn. Angel Spirit Guides, what would you like Capricorn to know for the week of the 1st of August? The week of the 1st of August. What do you desire right now? Visualize it and it will come about. Negativity will block your progress. Your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you realize. Still, they need nurturing and patience. So you've got that star, it's that dreams, if they're coming about in love, they are. But it, it, some things need a bit of... No, don't be too quick to go to the battlefield with someone because you won't be able to get to a destination and you'll take on these people's dramas, but you, you've got enough of your own problem. And, I mean, you have got these two counsellors here. There could be money from counselling or um, an offer. Angel spirit, guys. Victory, your desire is coming to fruition. Keep up the good work. Angel spirit guys, what would you like? A cup of course. No, so we've got two more or three more. Spend time alone in nature, meditating about your desires and intentions. Ask the angels to help you gain a positive perspective. I am the angel of abundance. You will receive the money that you need, and God is in charge of how that will happen. Have faith. And moon cycles. Notice how the moon affects your energy and manifestations and capitalise upon these cycles. So you might get this money, there's someone caring, someone that's very watery and emotional, but there's this devil involved, and it's it's kind of, you, you can't move because of this devil, and they're angry, and they might have been talking about you, so you feel closed in. But you do get this, it says you're safe, I'm protecting you against lower energies and guarding you, your loved ones and home, that's come out as well. So you might have to concentrate on the heart, loving yourself and the stability and money within the family. And um, the money's coming. Spend time alone. Be patient and visualise what you want. She's painting the flowers to her wedding while she's wearing the wedding dress, you see. It's like go to the detail of things. Plan it. If you've got this money, plan that money out. Um... Don't be sideswiped by the devil because they just might want your money or you might find this out. Um, yeah, so amongst this, there is a wish coming true. There is a wish in love coming true. It's just that someone might be a bit overthinking something and then you'll take on the dramas of other people. Um, and there's no need. Capricorn, take care of yourself. I hope I've helped you. And um, I'll speak to you soon. Please like, share and subscribe. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.